Hi, hi. I hope you people are well. You are fine. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for coming back again to watch my video. I really appreciate it a lot. So you people, you're most welcome. It has been a journey. It has been a long way. Okay. Growing social platform is not an easy job. Uh, especially growing YouTube, it's not an easy job. It's not an easy job, right? It's not an easy job, but we keep on going, especially uh, YouTube. Uh, uh, people have been reaching out, telling me, Anne, why, now, and nowadays you don't create content. It's not that I do not create content. I create content, but uh, uh, people are not getting the notification. I don't know why. I have no uh, uh, clue why I do not get the notification. Uh, people do not get the notification. But anyway, we have to keep on moving regardless. Okay. So uh, YouTube, it has uh, been a long journey. It has been a tiresome journey. Uh, I think so the only thing that it's keeping me going, it's like I'm just doing it like a hobby. I'm sharing my life with you people. And I'm also show, showing you around um, Germany. So that is okay. But if I was doing it as a career, then I'll be depressed. I can say that, you know. But the goodness is I'm going to work. And this one I'm just sharing with you and make it as a hobby. You get it. So uh, I have also Facebook. One account I have 50,000. Yes. One account I have fifty thousand, and uh, another account I have uh, fifteen thousand. Yes. So this one for fifty uh, uh, for this one for fifty thousand, I am always talking about uh, online dating, how I got my husband, and just encouraging people to be also careful because I all got my husband online, yeah. So I'm always talking about this topic, online dating, and uh, just because people back at home in my village, they, they actually did not know where I got my husband. Even my dad himself never, uh, he died not knowing where I got my husband, okay? Uh, yeah, because it's not uh, something that is known in the village, or it's not something that uh, people are used to it. So I'm enlightening people. And to be honest, I... I decided yesterday, but one to count, uh, to count the number of people that I've got, uh, these, uh, partners since I started, uh, I realize I've got, uh, 136 people that have already united with their people, leave alone these people who are coming and going, but this one, they're like united. They have already wedded and they're in their different specific countries. All right. So I I'm bringing an impact in a community just by creating awareness and also telling them the do's and don'ts. And uh, mostly I'm using Swahili. But nowadays, since people are following me, many of them are mixing Swahili and English. OK, so that's what I'm doing. And it has grown. It has grown like uh, really fast within. I think it's now within seven months. And I've reached 50,000. And to be honest, 50,000, uh, growing also Facebook, it's not easy. Growing Facebook, it's not easy. I'm remaining with one, with one step to get monetized on Facebook. Only one step. I'm getting, uh, maybe even I'll be monetized this week, you know. And then that is it on that platform. And then I, I have uh, the, the 15,000 uh the 15,000. That one, I'm doing almost the same thing as YouTube, talking about German village life. And I'm doing my lives on uh, uh, in English. Every day I go live on, on uh, TikTok. And by the way, uh, even now this platform, people have already turned it also to be an online because people are coming to ask, oh, where did you get your husband? And that one now will throw me to the online dating. You get it. So it's like we are talking this uh, uh, thing. And that one I started like uh, three months ago and I've reached 15,000. It's also growing up very fast. And <laughs> let me tell you, now this is also funny because uh, I'm also remaining with one step to uh, reach there, to reach the monetization. 
So you know what? This uh, platform, the village, the the I call it Operation Taftabuana. The other one that I've reached now, fifty, the one that is talking about online dating. That one. Uh, there I there is somebody. It was just uh, like a mistake because my nephew worked on it and he showed me. So there is a day I tried to go live and when going to a live, it refused. It refused to go live. So it's me who had done a uh, wrong settings. So I decided to contact someone. I thought maybe somebody has hacked my account. I gave my logins to this person. That is when I lost this monetization, whatever, because the person was in Kenya and then they were not monetizing Kenya that time. They have just started monetizing Kenya. I, uh, this, this month, yeah, this month, they have started monetizing Kenya. That's why that Swahili platform is going to be monetized. Else, they were not monetizing in Kenya. And I was using Swahili. I was not qualified for that, despite the fact I was having many people. So they demonetized me, you know, because my account was read in Kenya. And to make the story short, that person hacked my account and he took everything from me. He put under his name, but it's just God's grace. I had to contact my nephew who worked in, uh, in the same company and then he worked for me and he corrected this thing, but he had taken it. This was a difficult time. That was the same time I, my dad is dying like this morning and this thing had happened last, last night. It just happened in the same time. I was like confused, you know. I was like, what should I do? Should I just leave the account to go? Or it was that time by 15,000, yeah. But now my nephew corrected it and now it, uh, it belongs to me. So it's just something that I did myself. I pressed a setting of not putting the video public, but uh, only me can see the video but he told me there is somebody who had hacked it you know because i trusted him this guy we used to go together in the church at uh, the same church in kenya we used to fellowship together it's a person that we are praying the same god we are going to heaven at uh, the same heaven but still he did this to me anyway that was not a thing so those are some of the challenges also i've been facing on this social platform okay uh, the village one is doing on well. Another thing that it's now the challenge I'm facing on that uh, platform, the challenge I'm facing on the platform, people, many people have opened their, have opened their pages using my name. They are using like Anna Fula G and they are calling people. In fact, I'll just share here. So when you meet it, just know it's not me. They are using Anna Fula G and it's not me. And they're asking people for money. They say, come, I'll give you. Uh, they're using this word because they know majority of us Africans, we are so desperate. We need, uh, um, we need white people. So people have been conned. This woman or man has been making money almost 20,000 per day just using my name. And for me, I'm doing this work just for free. I'm not asking anyone any single cent. So that is the thing. And uh, I'm working on now getting the badge. I'm working on how to get the badge so that people just know this is me and nobody can lift my content and put it out there to con people. So that is one of the challenges I'm getting on Facebook. Now let's go to another platform that is TikTok. TikTok, I also have two platforms. One, I talk about village life. Now this is also almost the same as YouTube. I use English. And by the way, the village one in face, on Facebook, I'm using English, by the way. I use English and uh, I have 15,000 or 16,000 followers. And the other one that now I'm, do, I'm doing, Operation Taftabwana, the online thing, I'm doing it in Swahili and I have 110,000 followers. Yeah, 110,000 followers. And uh, yeah. Uh, you, a TikTok to report account is very fast. It's very fast because there was also a, a person who opened um, uh, to, who opened account under my name and he was uh, downloading my own videos and posting there. And he was also asking for money. So people came and gave it to me. I reported and they they uh, pull, pull it down. Also, my people in the community, they pulled it, they reported and pulled it down. But Facebook, it's so hard to report someone. 
Because um, this account, people have been reporting, but still they're there. People have been reporting and reporting, reporting, but still they're there. Uh, the accounts are, are still there. So this is also another challenge, growing this uh, uh, social platform. Otherwise, uh, and it's not easy. Remember, I'm a mother. I have toddlers. They need me more than anything. I need to make content. I need to make videos. I need to post. I need to react to the... I need to react to to all these six so two two seven social platform seven social platform youtube facebook facebook tiktok tiktok and uh yeah yeah yeah, yeah five, six six so it's not like uh it's easy i have to react to their uh, to reply to their comments i have to react to i have to reply to their inbox i have more than 80 inbox every day from different uh platform so it's not easy but i keep on do going and i do it just from my heart it's not that i'm asking anyone to pay me anything it's not that i'm i'm i've opened this just um for the sake of it but it's helping people honestly speaking it's helping people people are being helped yeah and my motto here is not like you have to look for white. No, my motto in these uh, platforms, by the way, I always tell them you look for partners, but don't look for race. Okay. And for sure, it's working for, for people out there. So that is it, my people. When you don't see me, just know I'm a little demotivated about uh, posting uh, first, uh, YouTube videos. And YouTube videos, to be honest, is the most... Uh, demanding thing because you have to edit these videos uh you have to to do a lot of things you know and then when you post and you get nothing you get a little bit uh demotivated but the other platform it's not that too much uh anyway i cannot say it's not that too much because you also need to do a lot of work editing and doing like this and this but this one you have to do like a lot that's the reason why i'm not posting like every day and uh yeah but there is no week I've ever, uh, I've ever stopped posting. I do post every week, each and every week. And since the holiday is loading, I'll post even more. Otherwise, thank you for watching. And kindly don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, share, uh, like, comment, and uh, subscribe. Okay? Bye. See you in the next one.